everyone, welcome back to Auburn Claire Beauty and another edition of the five minute review. Now, let's face it, my reviews have never been five minutes. I have, I think, one that's underneath five minutes and the rest of them been over. But I definitely wanna make sure I have enough time to talk about the product and to make sure I give a, a rather complete answer. But I also understand that some people don't want to wait through 10 minutes of video just to find out if I like something or don't like something. So I'm going to change up the format a little bit. And from now on at the beginning, once I've, after I've introduced the product, I will tell you if I like it or don't. And then those of you who want to find out why I don't like something or why I do like something, you can stick around for the rest of the video. So today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to be reviewing some hair care products. Now recently I ordered some eyeshadow and some other things from Ulta Beauty, uh, including the eyeshadow I just did a review on uh, Nabla a Cutie Palette in Midnight. Uh, there'll be a link below and you should see a little tag up top here if you haven't checked out that video but when I did order that I received a little gift bag from Ulta Beauty and I reached down here and grab it so I got one of these I mean it's a pretty substantial bag and it's full of sample products which I love love sorry <laughs> so I'm dropping things everywhere but that's okay it's, it's kind of how I roll so one of the things I got in this bag of goodies is a triple sample pack from a company called Fakai. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. And they gave me samples of their Shea uh, product line. And I have a Shea shampoo, the intense mask, and the gel cream. Now, as you can see, my hair is curly. I usually have it up in the ponytail so you can see the makeup better, but I am always looking for shampoos and whatnot that bring out the curl in my hair. Now this is a product that I haven't heard anything about and so I was excited to try it. Now like I said I'm going to tell you right off the bat if I like it or don't. I like it. I think it smells wonderful. It leaves my hair very nice. I um, am not very keen on the gel cream. It's not that it doesn't work but it just works okay for me and I'm a little biased, so I'll be right up the front, or right, tell you right up front, because I'm not one that likes a lot of uh, product in my hair. I, I, I prefer to be natural. That's why usually when I have it down in my videos, you're gonna see some flyaways, you might see some frizz. I kind of liked a little bit of a wild look. Sometimes I don't, but I usually do. I like that just kind of the way it feels and whatnot. Now, for those of you who do like a little bit more control in the hair. It does a pretty good job, but I've tried other things like um, just some hair oil or whatnot after I've shampooed and conditioned when I've stamp put in that does a better job on my hair than a uh, cream product. So I, that one's kind of a pass, but the Intense Mask and the Shea Butter Shampoo, I really enjoyed. They are $25 for an 8.5 ounce bottle at Ulta. And you know what? I think it could be, I, I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. Now, if you're shampooing your hair every day, it can get expensive, so you might intersperse it with other um, I don't, uh, other shampoos that you might have. But if you're shampooing your hair every other day or whatnot, I think it's worth the money, absolutely. Now, let me go into a little bit about why, further on, why I like this product. Now, I, like I said, right off the bat, I opened it up and smelled. It just smells so good. It, um, it's not overpowering. I have uh, some Redken products that I like, but the perfume in it, although it smells good, is so strong. That like burns my eyes and, and I have to, I mean, I like the results enough. I keep using it, but I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't open my eyes while I use it. This, this is subtle. This is nice. It's, it's a kind of a mellow fragrance to it. So I really like the shampoo and it rinses out nicely and you can feel, uh, it's not greasy, but you can feel that it has moisture, that there's, um, 
it, it's not your hair's not as dry I mean there's just just some um, more oomph to the hair now the intense mask the intense mask, when I read the instructions, say if you want a tighter curl to use it after a conditioner. Or if you don't, you can use it as the conditioner. Now, they didn't send me the conditioner. They sent me the shampoo, the intense mask, and the, and the gel cream. So what I did is I, I wanted to try a tighter curl, and I used my... Uh, conditioner I normally use, which is from a company called AG. So I use the intense mask and it re this stuff is thick, but it didn't weigh down my hair. That's my problem with my curls and whatnot. And with a lot of uh, curl shampoos, it tends to weigh down my hair and for the extra hydration. And then it, it kind of just goes the opposite way. My hair doesn't feel good. I don't like it. But this, this was nice. This super thick, but it rinsed out. It didn't, it wasn't heavy. And again, it had that same fragrance. Very, very nice. I really liked it. And I've used it twice now. I wanted to give this, before I got on camera, a, a good uh, two rounds of, of using this in the same way. So I can go, yeah, this, this is good. And how I usually do is I wash my hair and I go to bed with my hair wet and I wake up in the morning and I have curls. And today, like I said, it, I don't, the only product I have is I did use some hairspray. I literally woke up, finger combed, this is finger combed, little hairspray, and that's it. That's it. Done. So it, it, I love it. It's very bouncy. It's fun. It's beautiful. It's very full. It does not feel heavy, does not feel weighed down. I like this. This is super nice. Very, very nice. I enjoy this. I highly recommend it. And something too was something like this that I, I, I really appreciate. And granted, your hair is your hair. You might need to uh, do other things to make it work for you. But I don't spend a lot of time on my hair. I need something that I can literally like to talk about wash and go because I have learned for me, I, I can do my hair and spend the time and really do it up, make it look beautiful and, and fancy, but it just takes time. I like to do the makeup. Now, if it's a special event, I will take the time to do both hair and makeup, but I don't have that much time in my day to do both. So I always look for something. If I'm going to take the time to do the makeup, which for me, that's what I enjoy. I like to do my face painting. I'm going to look for a product for my hair that I can use and be quick about. So that's something I really enjoy about this. And, th and that's something too, that uh, I think with <sighs> so many times we try to do it all and try to make it all fit in and then you kind of lose a joy or something. So find ways to cut corners if you can. Uh, maybe something you don't like for me, I'm just going to wash and go. If I have some frizz, some flyaways, I'm okay. I'll go for the jungle look. Roar! Be a lion. I'm all right with that. And I'll do the makeup. I just want everyone to enjoy their creativity, enjoy their time and find ways to enjoy things like hair care or makeup and not be trying to do it all because this channel, like I said, it's a lot about self-care and I want us to make sure that we incorporate that when we're doing fun things like trying makeup and whatnot. As a little self-care tip, you probably already know this, but sometimes it's always good to say again, you don't have to do it all. You don't have to do it all. Pick the things that you really like that are important to you and focus on those. Everything else, like little frizz, little flyaways, not important, not important. That's all I have for you today. I'm so glad you joined me. I really enjoy this. I love my, my lion mane look here I got going. I hope that you try this product. I don't know if they have any travel sizes, but you might check out Ulta, see if they do. I believe they do have this in the store. And I wish you a happy day, rest of the day. Have a wonderful day whenever you see this. And I'll catch you next time. We'll see you soon.